Hello, KCD aspirants. How are you guys doing? I am sure must be busy. Board exams on the corner. KCET on 18th of April. Very less time left. How to prepare for everything? But to help you, Diksha has done some good analysis of physics paper of KCET. Now there are 30 chapters in KCET physics, both from PU1 and PU2. Now how to prepare? Which chapter is important? How much time to spend on which chapter? Now, that's a big task, and you should know that. How would you get to know it? If you analyze the past year's papers, this information will be available. So, to help each one of you, Diksha has come up with an analysis of past five years of physics question paper for KCET. And that too, chapter wise. So, what we are going to talk here is in every chapter in the past five years, how many questions have come? That would determine how important that chapter is. All right, so ready? So now we start with the analysis of every chapter for the past five years, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. So we'll assume that the nature would again be same as 2024. No guarantees, but expect the similar kind of behavior in 2024. So let's see, physical world, first chapter, Sometimes there is one, sometimes there is one, sometimes there is zero. So I'm not sure whether this would be there in 2024 or not. If I say there are three kinds of chapters, one is should do, definitely should do. One is could do, one is do. Okay. So in that thing, I would say physical word is do, right? Units and measurement, if you have got time, if you got lesser time, I'll talk about some priority chapters also, but this is a could do or medium importance chapter. Now see, motion in a straight line is similar. We could, could do this chapter, right? So we have got one question, one question, one question, one question, one question. So in 2024 also, you can expect one question from here. All right. Similarly, units and measurement also, you can expect one question. Now see, motion in a plane. So initially during years, they gave two and four questions, but the past two years, they've been giving one question, one question. So we expect say one to two questions can come from motion in a plane. So in 2024, you may get one or two questions from motion in a plane, okay? Now laws of motion, every year there has been one question that has been coming in. So of course, this is could do chapter, and we expect one question in 2024. Similarly, motion in a plane is also a could do chapter. So there are priority chapters which are from PU2 because you know, 25% of the question paper would come from PU1 or 11 and 75% of the entire paper is going to come from PU2, which is 12, okay? Now let's go to the next, next chapter, which is work, energy and power. So average, there has been one question coming in. So this again is a could do chapter. Now, please understand these chapters. When I say could do, does not mean they are not important. They are in the lesser order of priority. Important sub hai. Bas priority thodi si kam hai. Okay, so aage hai. Next chapter is system of particles and rotational motion. Now see, two, one, one. For the past two years, there have been per here are two questions that have been coming from it. So I would place this under should do. You cannot ignore this chapter at all, which is system of particles and rotational motion. Gravitation, gravitation. So one, one, one did not come one. So there is a possibility that you may get, you may not get a question from gravitation, but I'll put it as could do, because last year I hai. Now, mechanical properties of solid, every year one, so should do. See, every year one, 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 one question. Definitely I have. Mechanical property of fluids, they skipped in 2022, they gave in one, so let's put it a could do range here. That's also could do chapter. Thermodynamics, very, 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 <clears throat> I would say should do chapter. Uh, it's sometimes it becomes very, very favorite of the examiners. So they give questions. But remember, all these questions we all, from all these chapters usually would be, you know, 80% uh, of the time formula based. 
So just make sure that you have all the formulas absolutely ready and prepared. All right, now let's move to the next part of it. So kinetic theory, you see, it sometimes comes, sometimes doesn't, sometimes comes. So I would place this under the category of do, right? Not could do, but do. So this is the lowest priority as of now based upon past five years. Oscillations every year, there is one, one, one question coming in. So you can expect in 2024, there would be one question that would come from oscillation. So oscillation goes into the category of exactly. It goes into the category of could do. Waves, yeah, I mean, I would still say it would, you can expect one question from waves coming in and uh, in 2024, so I would praise that could do. So again, could do is not less important. It is just, I'm going to do these chapters only after I have completed all the other top priority chapters. And top priority chapters mainly come in PU2 or 12th, okay? All right, all right, all right. Now, this is where your PU1 ends. We go to PU2 or 12th chapters. Okay, let's see. Electric charges and field. Very, very important chapter. Two question, four, 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 three. So in 2024, you may expect some three to four questions coming from electrical charges. So this becomes your should do chapter. Should do, should do. You cannot leave it. Electrostatic potential and capacitance. See, three to four questions. Again, this again is a should do. Three to four questions are coming every, 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 every year. Okay. Current electricity, extremely, extremely important. I told you that if you start to study it, then start it. If you start revision, start to study it. Six to seven questions coming in every year. So this is double, double should do. You may expect six to seven questions coming from current electricity. Now, don't worry about this particular table. We have given a link in uh, the uh, comment section. You can download this link and whatever information I've put in here, is available there also, okay? So moving charges and magnetism equally important to current electricity. See, five questions have been coming every year without fail. So you can expect five questions coming in 2024. So the chapter is should do. So if we look at it, first we start current electricity and moving charges. This particular list is something where you should start your revision from, okay? Magnetism and matter, one or two questions coming in. So this becomes on a little lower priority. Unimportant nahi hai, little lower priority. I would place it under could do. You may expect one to two questions from this chapter. Electromagnetic induction. See, three questions every, every year. Beach mein ek bari one aya, but you've got three questions every, every year. It's extremely critical chapter. I would place it under could do so. You see, current electricity, moving charges, electromagnetic induction, they are like backbones that you have to start with. So you may expect three questions from electromagnetic induction. Now, the next chapter is AC or alternating current, okay? So then you have got three to four questions from this chapter coming in, alternating current may, and I would put that under uh, should do chapter. It's a should do chapter and you may expect some three to four questions in 2024 also, okay? Then there are these are all from 12th PU2, all very, very important chapters. None of them is lesser important than the other. Electromagnetic waves, you have got one or two questions coming every year. So I would place this just like, you know, uh, I would say magnetism and matter. I would say this is a could do chapter. Sorry, electromagnetic induction is a should do chapter. Electromagnetic waves could do chapter. One to two questions is what you can expect. It is not unimportant. I'm repeating this. It is just lower in priority. Ray optics and optical instruments, very, very important. <coughs> I've seen kids getting confused in this ray optics and optical instrument chapter. In case you want, Diksha can help you. We are running a KCET crash course. 
we are going to teach all these chapters we are going to teach cover all the chapters in the same way that i am telling you so ray optics and optical instruments four to five questions are going to come this is a definite definite these are definite definite should do chapter you may expect some four to five questions coming in 2024 for this so see within this particular slide 1234567899 nine chapters three to four questions roughly roughly 36 marks 36 questions aapka 50% exam to idhar hi hai please understand you got it it's right here very very critical now let's move to the next part of it wave optics right so wave optics again from 12th an important chapter three to four questions you can expect see 19 20 21 22 23 some three to four uh, questions you can expect from them in this particular so this becomes a should do chapter and 2024 you may expect some three to four questions from this okay important chapter dual nature of radiation to likha hua hai teen questions dunga KCET says I will give three questions from this, so you will expect three questions, and with this, I would say this chapter again is a should do. Okay, atoms. एक joke है, सुनाऊँ? Atom में क्या है कि do not trust atoms. They make up everything. Okay, <laughs> just coming back. Atoms में you see three, two, two, three questions are there. They they come. So. Again, a should do chapter. Yes, it is a should do chapter. You may expect some two to three questions here. Nuclei. Nuclei again, similarly like atom. It is a should do. You see three, two, three, three, two. Now next is semiconductor. Now see three to four questions are given. Easy questions are there. Zarur padiye. Important chapter hai. Read the theory properly. Learn some formulas. You can very well go ahead and crack these questions from this. So with this, this gets the category of should do chapter. With three to four questions coming here, and communication systems. अरे बाबा ये तो दिया ही नहीं. No, no, no. But this is a do chapter. जाने से पहले एक बार चेक कर लेना. Although there is no negative marking in uh, KCET, but still, just go through this chapter. Now see, we had some thirty-six to forty marks in previous slide. Let's see here. One, two, three, four, five. Five here. Three to four question. Twenty. Thirty-six. Plus some fifteen twenty, so you see most of that your chapter or your sorry most of the physics paper is going to come from these two slides. Very very important. Don't worry, guys. I have put into the comments the PDF of this entire analysis right there. Download it, take a print out and use it. Or agar in sab chizon se bachna hai, if you don't want to do all these things, please come and join the crash course that Diksha is running. immediately starting after your board exams a 28 day course where we are going to make sure that you cover up all these things all the chapters with lot of tests more details in the video which is in the comment so all the best for your board exams guys and all the best for kcet see you in the next video